Hey guys and welcome to today's video. So today guys, I'm going to be talking about something quite controversial and that is Bitcoin mining. Now, there's a few things that have been alarming to me recently um, regarding profitability and obviously the price action. First of all, I just wanted to apologize as the upload schedule has been lacking a bit, but now I'm looking to ramp up things on the channel. So do let me know if you guys want anything specific covered and I'll do my best to do so. So first of all, I wanted to take a quick look here at the coin market cap. We're currently sitting at a market cap of around 282 billion so back under that 300 unfortunately looking to maybe even test that 250 if we do take a look here on the charts and we drag this a bit closer we can see that we did almost come down and test that 250 again it does look like we're starting to flatline here and maybe turn around which is positive but if you do take a look at the price action as you can see everything is still been going down or just cruising along in a sideways fashion so if we take a look at the charts here for Bitcoin, this is sort of what I've been watching this channel here, which is a bit of a descending channel. Basically, we've had a few touches on the trend lines here, and I was hoping to see a nice strong reversal around this point. We did bottom here at around 62.50, and if you do see the RSI on the daily, this was running under 30 at around 26 was its lowest point. And I was pointing this out over on my Instagram channel as a potential reversal indicator for Bitcoin and the rest of the market. As you can see, we have seen a little bit of price action come in to give us a bit of a reversal. However, it is wicking out a bit here and looking to maybe test again um, at these levels. So realistically, we want to see this to be a nice clean uptrend to potentially break out of this channel. If we do see it testing here again at this level, there's a chance we can break back through. Things are still pretty dry in terms of volume, although we've had some decent moves here. The volume really isn't supporting it and Bitcoin is just running its own race here. What I would like to see is maybe if we do test again is another rally up and we really do need to break out of this channel. The key point will be around 8,000 USD. Now what I wanted to talk about today specifically with mining is some of the factors including hash rate, uh, mining difficulty, profitability and that sort of thing. So the hash rate for Bitcoin mining is actually at an all time high right now and this is something that is quite alarming to a lot of people despite this downward price action we've experienced over Q1 and Q2 of 2018, the hash rate has been consistently rising throughout the year, which is very good to see. If we do take a look at some of the news as well, various different manufacturers have been developing different mining rigs and things like that to facilitate mining in a more efficient manner. Um, Nvidia has been a huge one. Asus has announced a mining master motherboard in late 2018 and much much more so if we do take a look at the video card industry here on Cointelegraph you can see that Nvidia which is a leading manufacturer for graphics cards their stock price was actually heavily correlated with the Bitcoin price itself so that's pretty interesting to note and basically the revenue growth has gone up um, stock prices of Asus and other companies have also gone up so it's good in terms of the mining in that perspective but what I wanted to talk about on a bit more of a negative point, I'm not trying to spread FUD here or anything like that, but it is a little bit concerning to me and I'd be interested to get some other perspectives from other people and some opinions on this as well, because the difficulty has been continuing to rise. Now, we do know that this is pretty generalized. Um, it does continue to increase over time. As the number of Bitcoins available left to mine becomes more reduced, the difficulty increases. Now, if we do head over here to Market Watch, what we can see is the cost to mine one Bitcoin everywhere around the world. So I found this pretty interesting. And what I wanted to do and show you is when you correlate these prices with the price of Bitcoin, you'll see that the profitability of mining Bitcoin is becoming very, very small. And the window for profit there is getting smaller and smaller by the day as Bitcoin prices are not really rising. And this is a bit concerning to me. So if we take a look here, for example, Australia, which is my country, the price to mine a Bitcoin here due to our power costs and things like that is almost $10,000. And obviously that exceeds the price of one Bitcoin. Therefore, it's not profitable unless you have some sort of renewable energy source or something like that. And basically, they've done a bit of an average here to find out the range of how much it costs to mine a Bitcoin. Pretty much varies from $530 in Venezuela 
to $26,170 in South Korea there as you can see so it's a pretty wide span and even when we do look down at some of the biggest miners so China's sitting just over 3,000 and US here at around just under 5,000. Obviously this article is about a month or so outdated so the prices may have changed here as well so make sure to keep that in mind now. The reason why this is concerning is because of this chart here. Now, this is the profitability of mining Bitcoin, essentially. So basically what it does is it shows you the mining profitability in terms of one terahash of mining power versus one US dollar. So essentially here, as you can see, basically with one terahash of mining power at today's rate, you'll only be receiving around 33 cents as per the mining profitability up here in US dollars. Whereas if we compare that to the start of the year, you're around $2.85, $3 per day. So that's pretty interesting. As you can see though, the it is trending down and that is something that's quite concerning to me. And if you do change the time frame here to all time, as you can see, obviously it was highly profitable when Bitcoin was first in its inception and in its infant phase and it has just been continuing to dwindle down. Now the main concern here for me is if the value of Bitcoin drops below the cost to actually mine a Bitcoin, the profitability is just not there guys and miners will stop, okay? So Bitcoin mining is basically essential to keeping this network live and keeping it running. And the reason why a lot of people do it is because it is profitable. We see these large operations all over the world, um, often set up in countries where the power is cheap and if it becomes non-profitable, they will simply pack up and move on. We have seen this in the past when the mining difficulty has seen a significant jump in a short period of time. And hopefully in a positive notion, this will be recognized by investors and large institutions and basically bring in some price action. Now, I'm not saying it will, I'm not saying it won't. Um, it's just a bit of a guess at the moment, to be honest. And like I said, that volume is really dwindling out. So we do want to see that start to pick up here. But that's pretty much it for today's video, guys. So let me know your thoughts on this, if it concerns you, um, if there's anything I'm missing here in this investigation. But other than that, please leave a like on the video, subscribe to the channel if you are new here, and click that bell to turn on post notifications as well. And until then, guys, I'll see you all in the next video.